Scott, I spent the day with a professional tutor who says because certain schools are moving to online learning, the demand for tutoring is at an all-time high. But what about for families who can't afford a private tutor? She says parents need to know what resources are out there to make the most of their child's education. Schools are educating its students. Terry Lynn Brewster was a teacher for 12 years and has been a professional tutor for the last 32. If we don't find a way to reach everybody, there's going to be kids that are going to be left out. She says students learning on a hybrid or virtual program may need extra help, and some students could fall behind. They're already struggling students, and if they can't learn in five days, they're going to convince themselves they can't do it in two. Jackson Public Schools is planning for a virtual only fall semester. As the largest district in the state, this could leave thousands of parents scrambling to find the proper resources. Because I want all of our kids to be happy and educated at the same level. Brewster charges $50 an hour, but the average cost of a tutor can range from $25 to over $80 an hour. So what about families who can't afford a private tutor? Brewster recommends using websites like Khan Academy, IXL, and educational YouTube videos to give students the extra help they need. I want to just go scoop them all up in the basket and say, come over here, we'll just tutor math all day. But I can't, we can't, I don't know how, I don't know what to do with that. That's just sad. And it breaks her heart knowing their students without internet access and the proper resources to learn from home. The old saying, it takes a village, that's going to be truer now than ever. She says it's going to take the whole community, parents, teachers, and leaders, to come together and make sure that no student is left behind. And Hines, Rankin, and Madison County will all have options of some form of distance learning depending on grade or personal preference. And whether your child is in, is in class five days a week, half the week, or staying home all together, Brewster says parents need to know what options are out there for their child. Live in Jackson, Cecil Hannibal, 16 WAPT News. <laughs>